Hello everyone and in this video we're going to be diving in depth into Clipchamp's features when it comes to being able to adjust a color and in here we're going to have this factor image and see what are the many ways by which adjusting color can improve the quality of what you're watching on any given space and so in here we have jupiter as taken from james webb's telescope and we are going to see a couple of interesting things to keep in mind when it comes to color adjustment one is first to gain access to adjusting color all you have to do is on your screen the timeline just click on the specific image of your choice and on the right side of the screen you're going to see a couple of interesting tabs to keep in mind your filter not really however adjust colors is something that is going to be really huge focus in here now once you click on this you're able to have many different types of adjustments to make on this image and let's see the implications of such as you move the dial from left to right and so for exposure of this image what we see is that it gets from really dark to really really bright so that is something to keep in mind it's almost similar to the term brightness resetting before moving to contrast we have this happening where we actually have something a little bit much more thicker in terms of the saturation of the color but in here it goes to really blend and it just like goes into the ghost let's put it that way so moving on to reset we have saturation next and uh, what happens is that this enhances the color and that is in contrast to contrast which means that it gets it really darker so that is definitely something to keep in mind now next is for temperature we have this to be really really hot but has to be really, really cold and so finally here for reset is transparency and this here is in contrast to exposure where for transparency you're going to see what is happening as you look at the top and the bottom of your timeline at the bottom we have a specific video of me and let's see what this will do to the video on this timeline and so when i drag the dial it means that you're going from a little bit more of a review planet here to now more of the image or video underneath the timeline and so whichever way that pleases you you go for it for reset i'm going to blend mode look at normal we have different blend modes in terms of multiply light we have screen we have overlay and those are the things to keep in mind fantastic to have this preview highlighted here why or before you click on the specific tab of your choice now let's see how we'll be able to apply this to a specific video which has a really plain like view as shown right here and it's not giving us those colors that will pop out and proper saturation it looks a little bit pixelated let's put it that way so enhancing adjusting the color will help give this image life and so to accomplish this all we do is just make some adjustments here by one of course playing around with the saturation and once you get that it brings out the color and we can see this here in contrast now to the other image where you see the red popping on the shirt area however the red is just a little bit dull like so that is one thing to keep in mind another one here is let's see the other part for saturation and um, for saturation what we see is that as we move the dial we see that to the left it gets to a little bit more of a black and white view however as you move closer to the right we have it brings out the specific color of your choice or all colors on that image well that as a result looks like it's from going from this to now going to this and so that is pretty fascinating here 
Now, next here is how about contrast? When you move it closer to the left, what we see is that it disappears slowly. However, when you drag it closer to the right, we are going to a much more harsher enhancement of the colors. So let's move closely to the center ish so that it actually has a nice calming effect on that image. And something like this looks a little bit watchable. And this in contrast to that, yeah, that is something to appreciate. Apparently, let's play around with the brightness here by dragging this a little bit closer to the right and not going to the left because <laughs> at the end you're not going to see anything but a little bit closer to the right that gives that interesting take on it now for me this is not of course a representation of how my actual videos are but for you this is something for you to play around with to see what best fits the mode of your video style and take advantage of these adjustment colors right here now let's see what blend has to offer if i have blend you can actually see the image below which is in this case a screen of a particular video that i'm trying to present so i don't even need to blend anything at all so i'm just going to keep it the way it is so here is before and here is after now let's know your thoughts about all this in the comment section down below about adjust color on clip champ and see you all on the next one all the same stay smart as always and believe in yourselves